गुड मॉर्निंग वन एंड ऑल टुडे टॉपिक इज स्टोक्स थीरम स्टेटमेंट एंड कार्टेशियन फॉर्म ऑफ द स्टोक्स थीरम ओके स्टोक्स थीरम कैन बी डिस्कस्ड इन द रिलेशन ऑफ लाइन इंटीग्रल टू सरफेस इंटीग्रल दैट इज नथिंग बट ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन ऑफ लाइन इंटीग्रल टू सरफेस इंटीग्रल द स्टेटमेंट ऑफ द स्टोक्स थीरम इज इन दिस स्टोक्स थीरम कैन बी डिस्कस्ड इन द रिलेशन ऑफ लाइन इंटीग्रल टू सरफेस इंटीग्रल दैट इज नथिंग बट ट्रांसफॉर्मेशन ऑफ लाइन इंटीग्रल टू सरफेस इंटीग्रल द स्टेटमेंट ऑफ द स्टोक्स थीरम इज इन दिस the surface integral means we can take let s be a closed surface it is bounded by a curve and which is non intersecting the curve c in this f bar is the vector point function then integral closed curve c f bar dot dr bar equal to surface integral curve f bar dot n bar ds where c is a closed curve it is a traversed closed curve bounded by a region and in this n vector is the unit outward drawn normal vector at any point of the surface this is the statement of the stokes theorem what is the stokes theorem stokes theorem it is the transformation line integral to surface integral line integral to surface integral the statement of the stokes theorem is let S B A surface is bounded by a closed non-intersecting curve C. non intersecting curve c if f bar is a differentiable vector point function f bar is a differentiable vector point function then the relation of stokes theorem in between of line integral to surface integral is line integral closed curve c f bar dot dr bar equal to surface integral curl f bar dot n bar ds where here c is a traversed curve in the positive direction in the positive direction and n bar is unit normal unit normal outward vector at any point of the surface at any point of the surface that is nothing but we are taking this is a x y z region here this is a plane and that is the image is then it is a bounded region closed curve c and which is non intersecting the surface s okay in this the cartesian form is cartesian form of stokes theorem means generally f bar is a vector point function it is denoted by f1 i plus f2 j plus f3 k 
and r vector is a position vector it is xi plus yj plus zk then dr bar equal to dr bar is dxi plus dyj plus dzk the dot product lhs equal to closed curve c f bar dot dr bar the dot product in between of these two vectors then we know that i dot i equal to 1 then it is f1 dx plus f2 dy plus f3 dz and curl f bar curl f bar equal to del cross f bar it is equal to determinant of i j k do by do x do by do y do by do z f1 f2 f3 it is equal to <coughs> i into elimination of first row and first column do f3 by do y minus do f2 by do z plus j into second row first row second column then the do f1 by do z do f1 by do z minus do f3 by do x plus k into do f2 by do x minus do f1 by do y it is the curl f bar that is del cross f bar in this the unit normal vector n bar n bar is a unit normal vector we are taking the coordinates that is cos alpha cos beta cos gamma or the coefficients of the i j k that is nothing but the normal vector is making angle with the x y z axis then n vector is equal to cos alpha i plus cos beta j plus cos gamma k then curl f bar dot n bar equal to dot product of in between of curl del cross f and n bar that is do f3 by do y minus do f2 by do z into cos alpha plus do f1 by do z minus do f3 by do x into cos beta plus do f2 by do x minus do f1 by do y into cos gamma. Then the closed line integral closed curve C f bar dot dr bar equal to surface integral curl f bar dot n bar ds. Then the f bar dot n bar is f1 dx plus f2 dy plus f3 dz. It is the line integral over closed curve C which is equal to surface integral curl f bar dot n bar ds is dou f3 by dou y minus do f2 by do z into cos alpha plus do f1 by do z minus do f3 by do x into cos beta plus do f2 by do x minus do f1 by do y into cos gamma whole ds it is the Cartesian form of the Stokes theorem. Okay, the Stokes theorem can be defined as transformation of the line integral to surface integral. That is nothing but the relation in between of line integral to 
surface integral in this the vector the function which is in vector point function and it is the differentiable vector point function if in the examination if they will ask verify the stokes theorem means just to you remember what is the integral closed curve c f bar dot d bar is equal to f1 dx plus f2 dy plus f3 dz by use comparing of that function you can find out the you can get the f1 f2 f3 functions from that you can easy to find out the value of this stokes theorem verification or evaluation of the stokes theorem okay thank you